This is a penny press or um, a corn elongation machine. <laughs> it does work. So we chose to use gears um, and do a gear sudden system to create basically uh, what's a standard uh, roller mill, except with a uh, die in here that has a design imprinted on. And what was cool about this project is it involved so many different departments. So um, as the MDIS students, we did the design for everything, but Brian, their machining instructor, Wire EDM, cut these gears for us. And then we ended up going to the machine shop to machine these side plates as well as the bottom plate. And then the roller design, Brian also uh, machined for us using the 4-axis CNC. Then in order to make things hard enough so that they wouldn't deform when we were squishing the penny, we ended up running over to Welding, who taught us how to case harden um, so that we could do that for our rollers so that they wouldn't deform at all with the design. So really a large department effort for this project. So we have the acrylic housing over here that it's going to go into. Um, with a slide so the pennies after we press them will slide outside of the housing so that nobody's fingers are near gears or anything and the handle will stick out this side. Dunwoody is one of the very few schools I've seen that has so much interdepartmental connections, especially with hands-on. So we had this idea, you know, knowing right off the bat that it was going to require a lot of machining and a lot of extra work and things that necessarily as the MDES program alone we can't do. So I don't think this would have been possible somewhere not at Dunwoody because it's just everyone was so willing to help and give a hand with everything, which was really phenomenal.